Hello everyone, and welcome to my Vanderpump Bombshell channel. Hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Ariana Medix's sweetheart, Daniel Y, took to his Instagram story on Friday to close down gossipy tidbits about the Vanderpump Rules star possibly undergoing surgery in front of her facilitating stretch on Affection Island, USA. As Ariana, 39, documented another allure against Rachel Raquel Levis' vengeance pornography claim against her and her ex, Tom Sandoval, 42, Daniel, 41, responded to a couple of inquiries on his web-based entertainment account, including requests about how to meet Ariana after her Broadway shows and her fit body. If you have any desire to meet Ariana Menix, after the show, she does the show entryway each and every time, and she takes pics, signs, and converses with everybody that comes to see her. She is super grateful for everybody. He composed. Then, subsequent to sharing some eatery suggestions, he noticed that his better half of more than a year was buckling down and eating right during her time in Fiji. For Adoration Island, he expressed, Ariana Medix worked her asterisk asterisk off. She was in rec center two to three hours a day and diet spot on. Sorry, skeptics, no medical procedure or systems. With respect to giving out the exercises I'd very much want, however, this is my business and I'd work doing this. He then incorporated a connection to his business. In other siphon rules news, Court reports got by in touch week after week on August 2 have affirmed that Ariana is engaging a July 11 decision and down her by an adjudicator demand for Raquel's claim against her to be excused. As fans surely understand, Raquel sued Ariana and Sandoval recently, blaming Sandoval for recording unequivocal FASTA time meetings without her assent and guaranteeing Ariana purportedly circulated the class to outsiders, which Ariana denied. I didn't send the recordings to any other person, nor did I offer, show, or show the recordings to any other person, Ariana told the court. Honestly, I just saw the video of Raquel, in places disconnected from others. Yet, after Ariana's solicitation, Raquel went against the documenting, saying that Ariana hurt her psychological wellness. It isn't simply that Ariana had found the accounts and went up against me about their items. Assuming that were all that occurred, Ariana could not have possibly been named in this claim. However, that isn't exactly occurred. She made sense of in-court archives. Ariana's suggestion that my emotional wellness battles were brief in term or minor couldn't possibly be more off base. I was in a condition of outrageous pain because of the occasions depicted in the claim, and I entered treatment in a very dim and terrifying spot intellectually. My side effects included extreme profound pain, actual signs of such trouble, tension, shock, shame, loss of confidence, shame, embarrassment, frail, restlessness, bad dreams, and loss of pleasure throughout everyday life. She proceeded. In her own sworn declaration, Ariana recognizes that she took and scattered them. She disseminated the accounts from their unique source on Sandoval's telephone to herself and to me at the very least. During the July 11 hearing in which an appointed authority denied Ariana's solicitation for excusal, that's what a request expressed Ariana's direct isn't safeguarded under the counter LEPP resolution on the grounds that the supposed lead was unlawful as an issue of regulation. Here, Raquel has convincingly exhibited Ariana's direct claim in the three reasons for activity was unlawful. An adjudicator noted, Ariana's announcement lays out that she got to Tom's telephone without Tom's information and assent. Her announcement shows that she had recently gotten to Tom's telephone with his insight and assent, yet makes no reference to her having Tom's agreed to do as such on this event. 
Ariana has documented her solicitation to upset the appointed authority's Tom choice Sandoval and terminated his attorney only two days subsequent to suing ex Ariana Medix. The Vanderpump Rules star took to his Instagram on Thursday to address what is going on subsequent to getting reaction from co stars over his choice to make a legitimate move against Medix, whom he dated for almost 10 years. Late Tuesday morning, my lawyer Matt Jaragos whose guidance I trusted, called be about the cross grievance in the claim against myself and Ariana. Sandoval composed on a dark screen after briefly erasing his record. He guaranteed me that the activity was standard and stringently precaution in these sorts of claims and asked me consent to it. He proceeded. Be that as it may, Sandoval guaranteed the expression's new claim and suing were not verbalized to him during their discussion. I ought to have been accomplished a greater amount of my reasonable level of effort regarding this situation, he conceded. After acknowledging what this activity really implies, I have taken out Matt Jerigos from my lawful group. Not the slightest bit am I suing Ariana, he explained. The activity against Ariana welcomed for my sake is being taken out. I hold no hostility or malice toward Ariana. By eliminating the cross grumbling and Jergos from the situation, Sandoval desires to push ahead with the legitimate matter rapidly so everybody in question can continue on with their lives. Sandoval's sentiment with Mendix scandalously finished in Walk 2023 after she learned he had been going behind her back with previous co-star Rachel Raquel Levis. The something about her proprietor found their months-long undertaking subsequent to seeing a close FaceTime video on his cell, which Levis later guaranteed he shot without her assent. Almost a year after the fact, Levis documented a stunner vengeance pornography body of evidence against the pair, guaranteeing Medix sent herself a duplicate of the Anacepta video. Then at that point, recently, Sandoval sued Medix for obtaining access to the unequivocal recordings of Levis on his telephone without approval or authorization. The 1-8 rocker claimed that Medix made duplicates of the recording and appropriated them to Levis and outsiders. In an ensuing explanation, the hitting the dance floor with the Stars alum's legal counselor considered the documenting and despicable endeavor to torment Medix and evade liability regarding the impacts of his activities. Be that as it may, preceding being terminated, Jericho's protected the claim. It was only a cross-grumbling against Levis' unique claim to demand it. This standard legitimate activity was significant to guarantee that obligation, if any, is genuinely appropriated in light of the real degree of contribution and shortcoming of each party. Jericho's told the power source, we mean to determine this lawful question with highest regard towards all gatherings included. Thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.